Welcome to our lecture online. We can actually show that the integral of 1 over x dx is equal to the natural log of x in a different method. So here's method 2. Again, we start with the power series that 1 over 1 minus x can be written as 1 plus x plus x squared plus x cubed and so forth. And now we're going to replace the minus x by a plus x. Now we can write that 1 over 1 minus a minus x, which is equal to 1 over 1 plus x, is equal to, and all we have to do is replace every x by a minus x, so this becomes 1 minus x plus x squared minus x cubed plus x to the fourth, and so forth. And now we're going to make one more substitution. Now we're going to let every x be x minus 1. So now we're going to let that equal to 1 over 1 plus, and here we're going to write this as, let's see, how about an x minus 1. So again, we'll take this expansion, and now we're going to replace every x by x minus 1. And notice that if I then take 1 minus 1, this simply becomes 1 over x. And 1 over x will then be equal to this with every x replaced by x minus 1. So that will be the next series. So we get 1 minus x minus 1 plus x minus 1 squared minus x minus 1 cubed plus x minus 1 to the fourth power and so forth. And this is a cube, by the way. There we go. Now we're going to make a substitution. Now we're going to let u equal x minus 1, and then du will be equal to dx. And so now we can take a look over here and say that 1 over x can now be written as 1 minus u plus u squared minus u cubed plus u to the fourth, and so forth. Now we can take the integral of both sides. Since du is equal to dx and u is equal to x minus 1, I can now say that the integral of 1 over x dx must be equal to the integral of this, which is 1 minus u times du, which means that this here can be written as the integral of the right side. And when we integrate that, we get u minus u squared over 2 plus u cubed over 3, minus u to the 4th over 4, plus u to the 5th over 5, and on and on and on like that, plus a constant of integration. And now we have to recognize that this is the power series equivalent of the natural log of 1 plus u. So this can be written as the natural log of 1 plus u plus a constant of integration. And since u is equal to x minus 1, and here we have 1 plus u, let's now replace u by x minus 1. So this is equal to the natural log of 1 plus the quantity x minus 1 plus constant of integration. Notice that the 1's cancel out, and this therefore becomes the natural log of x plus a constant of integration, which is what we're looking for as being the integral of 1 over x dx. And that's how it's done.